Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to discuss how to resolve error 190 in Windows Store. What you need to do is that you need to go to your start menu, go to settings, and this page will open date and time. There is two options here how you can resolve this error. The first one is to set time automatically. What you need to do is you need to click, click here and it will turn on set time automatically as well as set time zone automatically. With this, it will capture your current location time. And with that, your error should be resolved. This is one. The, f the second one is that you can set time zone manually from here. Let's say you want to, let's say, put it on. You are located in Hawaii. So you put Hawaii here. You have to select your current location. So, I'm, for example, I'm putting Hawaii. And uh, I, uh, I get out of the page and this is done. The error should have been resolved. Now, in case the error stayed, what you need to do is that you need to go to your control panel. So I'm going to search for control panel. Here is the control panel. I need to go to date and time here. And then I need to go to change time zone. Changing time zone, I need to put the same time zone of my location. So if it is on another location, you need to, you need to select your location. Let's say, okay, Hawaii. Okay. And then, because this was Hawaii already, um, apply is not there. But if, uh, if you made the changes, you need to click on apply and uh, finish it off. Now, after doing that, you again have uh, to go to your start menu and to settings, but uh, uh, instead of date and time, you need to go to region, click on region, and here you need to select the country that you are in. This is very important, you need to select the country that you are in, and, uh, uh, and that's it. And close the page. So in this uh, method, uh, your error should be resolved. Just in case with all these three methods, the error stayed, what you need to do is that you need to go to search to your search bar and search for recovery options. This is the recovery options. You need to click on it. And um, you have to go to advanced startup and they click on restart now and uh, you need to follow the instructions I will not restart now my PC but follow the instructions as well as I have put the, all the instructions how you go from start now uh, on the description below the video please look at it in case uh, you tried all the methods and it did not work out try this method I'm putting this uh, I'm putting all the steps step by step for this method in the description